As many folks in the Northern California College community of Arcata enjoyed the fun and festivities of St. Patrick's Day in 2011, Tracy Barnes Priestley and her husband Barry found themselves witnessing an office building they own, a quaint 130-year-old Victorian, suffer significant damage from a freak accident. Across the street from their property, a delivery driver inadvertently tangled his van into the guy wires that secure a power pole. As the driver pulled away from the curb, the pole snapped in half and the electrical transformer on the pole crashed onto the street. Immediately, 2,900 area homes and businesses were without power. Even worse, power surged into the Priestley's building, rupturing their gas line and destroying their furnace and water heater. A fire ignited in the building, causing significant damage to their tenants' offices. My husband and I have owned income property for a number of years, and we have never had anything like this happen. Fortunately, the fire department is just up the street. The police are right around the corner, so help arrived within minutes. The fire was put out. Uh, my tenants were all safe. Everybody was okay. And then the fire department said, you can go in and see what's happened. The damage was shocking. And this is an old building. It's on the historical register, so it was really sad. It's my business. We were sort of stunned. Having local claims representatives gives us a competitive advantage. Kathy Lewis, a CIG claims representative, lives in the Arcata area. As a result, she was able to respond quickly and take care of Tracy's needs. A little bit shaky, I called uh, Kathy at CIG and I was immediately put to ease because there was this, I don't know what I was expecting, but there was this instant personal connection. She was compassionate, she was listening, she was just like, I'll walk you through this, it'll be okay. Our focus is on benefit provisions, so we try to ensure that our customers have a clear understanding of the coverages available to them and how CIG insurance can help facilitate the claims process. It was a flawless process. I mean, here you are thinking, my business is on hold, my tenants are suffering, um, there's countless expenses and details. It wasn't just good business service, she, she sort of seemed to get the significance of this place. It took a few weeks, but life and business at the Old Victorian returned to normal. However, in conversations with other building owners, Tracy Priestley learned that her experience with CIG insurance was significantly different from her neighbors' experiences with their insurance companies. The delivery company and the driver were locked in a dispute about who would cover the claims. We took care of the Priestleys by paying their claim, and then we worked with the other insurance companies to get reimbursed. What I do for a living is teach customer service. She listened, she was clear, she did everything that I teach people how to do. And I thought she needs to be acknowledged for that because um, that's exactly what you want to be on the receiving end of, is that kind of customer service. 